everyone welcome back to my channel instant engineering so this is for uh, triple e students power systems 2 okay how to derive an expression in pu systems for a uh, single phase system okay so this comes under unit 3 okay so this is one of the expression which will be asking frequently i'll just make it uh, clear to you and easy to remember all right so see when sometimes when he's asking you uh, in uh, per unit systems in single phase how to derive the voltage current equations that's what we are gonna do here okay so just consider let s b is uh, consider this as base volt ampere okay and v b v b will be base voltage and uh, IB is base current okay and ZB that's impedance that is base impedance impedance okay so in single phase systems what happens is SB the base voltage ampere volt is for volts uh, voltage and ampere is for current okay so sb is nothing but it is uh, the base of this voltage and ampere that means the product of vb and ib all right so sb is nothing but vb into ib okay b is nothing but base values all right so after you do this you can also say this is the impedance impedance is nothing but always z is v by i v by i b here base values always remember z impedance means v by i okay so you got this right now consider this as equation 1 okay and consider this as equation 2 so from equation 2 okay what you can write this as z b z nothing but v b by i b okay so here what i am doing is multiplying and dividing by VB okay so it doesn't make any difference right so just to simplify this VB into VB okay Div multiply and divide by VB into IB so this becomes VB square okay VB into IB here sorry VB into IB okay so what we said vb into ib is nothing but s of b right so that's what we'll write here vb square divided by s of b so this is zb okay so we got this right remember this so here what we can do is just rewriting what we have got okay so see like from the first equation sb means what it is vb into ib right okay so now this units are volts this units are amperes so in general in power systems you can write this volt ampere can be written as mega volt ampere all right this vb means volts no if there is volt you can voltage you can write it as kilovolts also okay so now what i am doing see sb means v into a that is mva so this will become mva okay and vb is voltage that is kilovolt so if it is base we'll just keep b here okay for base so rewriting these two in this equation all right you will get zb is nothing but kv kv no base value just square by this is mva base value all right this is what the uh, impedance value is okay this is one thing all right now we will see uh, the per unit impedance can act it can also be written as per unit values can be written as actual impedance by base impedance all right so that means zpu is nothing but z by zb zb we already got over here okay we're just substituting here so z by this whole this whole value kvb square by mvab all right so this uh, will go to the numerator so the whole value will be zpu is equal to z into mvab divided by k 
kvb square okay so this is the per unit values in single phase systems all right this is the impedance value now we'll see the current values okay so current is nothing but i per unit is actual current by base current all right so this is nothing but i is equal to i by ib okay so ib is nothing but ib is uh, nothing but sb by vb so from the first equation if you go back there sb is vb into ib i said right so from this ib is sb by vb that's what how we got this one all right equation one just for your understanding okay after you have got this what we are going to do is uh, ib values we got okay and c sb means i said you know it can be written as mvab vb means v kv kvb okay uh, so from here uh, you can also say ipu actual current by base current base current is now what we have got over here ib right so i by mvab by kvb so this can also be written as i this will go to the numerator kvb by mvab this is how you will derive uh, the current and impedance values in single phase system okay if it is in three phase system it is very simple just add root three okay like see now the, here you are having uh, s by vb no here you'll just write three root three if it is three phase root three so this will be mva by root three okay here also uh, root three here also root three for three phase okay just easy understanding i'm telling you just root three add over here all right similarly for uh, uh, three phase impedance also just at the place of this sb is root three into vbib okay wherever vb is just add this okay so you're gonna get this like so this will be zb will be vb by root three ib all right uh, next uh, wherever it is you can just add this so this will be root three here so here you will get root three so this will be as it is same okay vb by sb square and similarly you will get this this will be exactly the same okay because we are just converting this values no so this will be same like i said everything will be same only in the current here you will be having root three that's it this is an easy way to remember if anyway in an exam he'll be giving this question i hope it should be very very easy for you to answer this i hope it's clear thank you